Okay, so we're going to show you how to flip a card animation and add a tint effect to make it slightly more 3D, uh, more realistic effect to it. So uh, we're going to be doing it with these two layers here, the top and bottom cards. So come over to your effects and presets, add tint, search for tint, and take that tint and drop it onto your top layer. Uh, the green card there. You'll see yeah, it's added this mask here. But as yet, there's no proper fading in tint effect. So I want to come up to here, back to white, click on the existing green color that will give you the dark shade. So as you can see there. But as you can see, it does not fade in, fade out yet. So you need to come down to your effects. Uh, go to amount to tint, click on the stopwatch there, that will drop your keyframe in and take your slider and bring it right down. That will leave you with zero tint at the start of the animation. Bring it down to the end of the animation and add the tint and then you will see the transition between the tint. So you get a good flipping over effect. And it's pretty much the same with the underside of the card, which is the blue bottom card here, this two. Apply the tint again. This time go to map to black. Sample the color again as you previously did. Drop it down, you will see the lighter shade, the lighter tint. So as with the other one, click amount to tint, drop your keyframe in. At the top of it here, you want 100% and at the bottom, you want it to be removed. So take this off to the final frame of the animation and take the amount of tint down to zero. And that should give you the transition effect of the bottom of the card. So we have the top of the card transitioning into the bottom of the card. You've got the shade going into the light. Okay guys, thanks for watching. You can find out more about us at satisfactionscript.com or find us on Facebook, Twitter or LinkedIn.